Oh, I see. They can't actually get up to this ladder, so once I drop off of this, I'm freaking screwed. Just pull me off the ladder. All right, welcome back to the Beer Mug Channel. Back in Seven Days to Die 1.0. We're heading off to a clear mission. It's not too far. It's called the uh, Cabin Retreat, I believe. Last episode, I got freaking murked by a damn zombie hit squad. <laughs> or I just really screwed up. I was just, it was like the end of the day. I was checking out this coffee shop, just a little POI. I saw like three zombies running in my direction. I was like, ah, oh, whatever, you know. And I kind of watched them because I thought it was weird. It didn't seem like a horde. It was just like three zombies. And they seemed like they locked in on me from further away than they should have. And they chased me down and frickin' murdered me and ate me. So I've got some penalty going on. Uh, experience penalty, as you can see down in the bottom. That's what the red is. Right above my toolbar there. I have to work that off before I start gaining experience again. Ran out of 7.62 ammo for the pipe machine gun. So I just built a pipe shotgun and a pipe pistol. Die, damn it. <laughs> I was not ready for that. Alright, I got a laceration. Is he dead? Okay, he's dead. Where's my damn bandages? Oh no, I don't have any bandages? Oh shit. And I'm infected. I'll be alright. I'll live. Yeah, the bleeding stopped. Son of a bitch. Yep, another mistake. No bandages. <laughs> I need to spend some time and just do some crafting, obviously. I'm going to have to go back to base. Heal up this, uh, or sew up this laceration. And get a honey. So let's look here. Last episode I made a bunch of storage crates. I'm sure I talked about it at the time. Yeah, no medical bandages. Shit. Use this sewing kit. I have to use this honey. That was my last honey, so I need to look for those. I'm going to start cutting some stumps again. All right, I need aloe cream and bandages. And I don't have any aloe cream. So I'll just take bandages. I'm going to make some more. That way I can at least stop the bleeding. Damn, that uses a lot of cloth. That's going to have to do. Actually, I had a first aid kit. I should just bring that with me. Stupid not to. As much as I don't want to waste it, I'll bring it. All right, let's try this again. So it is day six. There's a possibility that the horde will come tonight. I should have enough time to knock out this mission, get to the trader, get back to base, and fortify things. Just in case. There's a honey. Not really healing at all. Try to eat and drink. All 
There we go. What's this? It's a dead body. Okay, moving slow. I don't recognize this. Generator. Destroy generator. I think I have some points. Oh yeah, I got three points. I'm going to use these quick. Let's try putting one into Lucky Looter. Let's try to do that relatively early in the game. I'm going to put one into Boomstick, which I usually don't use shotguns very much, but since I was able to build a level 3, I'm going to do it. That's 10% more damage, 10% faster fire rate, 10% faster reload. I also put one into medium armor. I don't see a light armor anymore, so we'll do that. That's, that's what I'm going for. Point blank. Alright, do I need to worry about the floor here? It looks like there's dirt underneath that. What key rack? I'm going to activate that. And I want to check out front. Oh, I can't really get anywhere with this. I guess I can go that way. It's always good to have another escape route. Something's coming in. Oh, he's trying to get in. It's close. You get down. Probably be smart to put down a hatch just in case. Can't shoot that out of the way. Ow, big guy. Repeatedly. <laughs> like that. Uh, something else here. Oh, uh, maybe on the roof.
Alright, that's it. Pretty easy one. There we go. There's two bandages. Guess that's it. Looks like that's about it for this one. Back to the trader. Make sure everything's loaded. There's another honey. Perfect. Good to have a backup. So I need to strategize about the horde layout of the base. I'm going to think on that. I like the idea of fighting the horde from the top of the shipping container, to be honest. There's another honey. Shit, yeah. Alright, all good. Gonna go see the trader. Grabbed a couple things out of the sellables chest that I had. Damn. Well, I guess I'm gonna have to pay you now that well, you Well, what do you have? Not much, really, do you? I think I'll take gunpowder. Alright, what have you got? You take a clear. Take your cell. You need some more. Pete's hidey what? hole. <laughs> what kind well, of name is luck. that? By the looks of it. You want Let's something? See what he's got. I want to sell a couple things. I'll sell this ranger hat. Sell this money. And I'll sell this book. Up to 900 bucks. Take a couple red tea. I was hoping for some aloe or some uh, bandages, like some medical bandages. Alright, back to base. I'm going to cook and prep for the horde. Alright, so let's look at this. I'm going to be upstairs. I won't be downstairs. So the only place they can get up is here. Or they can get up over there. So I cut that ladder out. So if they're coming up this thing, I'm going to want to be fighting them level. So I have to build something up here, possibly. Or, we take out this. Take out this ladder. Let them come up that wooden ladder and have to come across this. I think that's the play. Because they do not go across this well. Cut some of this out. And then they really won't go across that well. Okay, there's two sections of ladder taken out. I don't think I can even jump up to that right now. No. Maybe if this thing wasn't in the way. I could try taking this out. Yeah, I still can't make it. Alright, so the only way up is that ladder over there. Looks like. Let me take a quick spin around and just make sure. Oh, I didn't even, I never even got this crate right here. <laughs> Damn. So there's definitely a possibility they could stack up and figure out a way to get up through this. It would be pretty awkward. It would only be like one at a time probably. And they'd have to beat through this concrete ceiling, which is ungodly tough. Yeah, I don't see anything else there. I don't see anything here. Once again, well, they might be able to get up this. Huh? 
Oh no, that one's tough as shit though. Yeah, that block's too tough. How tough is this? 2,500. So that's decent. What about here? Well, again, that's just going to be a fluke if they actually like figure out to get up that. Could probably take out a couple sections of this. They'll actually destroy this, I'll almost guarantee it, to the point where none of them can even get up it. Got a couple more murky water. So that's good. So the main spot they're going to get up is going to be here. I don't think any are going to be able to get across that. If I just go here and hang out here and fight the horde from here... I don't think I have much to worry about. If any get through here, it's not going to be only but one or two. Alright, well I have lots of spikes. I got an achievement for placing the spikes. I need to try to not fall on those myself. I want a backup spot where I can get back onto this, and this looks promising. I can just jump all the way up here. Can I jump across? Hopefully without breaking a leg. I can. It's a little sketchy, but I can do it. If I could put up some bars right here, that would be better. Alright, bars upgraded there. We're going to upgrade here also. Maybe we make some goofy freaking bars barrier thing here <laughs> that's so damn freaking ugly It might actually work. If I can put something over the top, it'll be perfect. <laughs> it's working. There. Perfect. A little bars cage here. Alright. Almost time for the horde. If it comes... I need torches. We're just going to throw them out. It's ugly as hell. There. Torches up. Maybe we'll be able to see a little bit. I can walk right over that. Here we go. Nope, nothing. No horde. Alright, so no horde means I've got time to kill. I'm going to head out and head towards this mission. feel pretty good about the base setup. So I'm going to see what I can get. This is uh, Pete's 
hidey hole or some shit. <laughs> Something goofy like that. go wooden club quality too. I'm gonna build that right now. Put the spikes on it. Perfect. Alright this one's outside of town always. It must be a wilderness POI. I saw an arm break off on that shot. Oh, shit. I need this deer. I need to not let it get ate by that zombie first. Okay, here we are. This one's looking sketchier by the minute. Pete's hidey hole. Some underground bunker. Underground damn mushroom cave. <laughs> Pete, Pete was growing some freaking badass freaking psilocybin down there. I don't like these damn trees. Can't see anything. I'm just going to make a storage crate right now. Check this place out. Uh, are we gonna fall through a hole into a damn cave or do I go down this way? Oh, here we go. I see a zombie. going on here? What was that? I have a way out. We got this big guy over here. I should have taken care of him before I started this, probably. Oh, 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 here we go. Alright, that ladder looks good. There's one. Oh boy. This is pretty damn crazy.
Oh, I see. They can't actually get up to this ladder, so once I drop off of this, I'm freaking screwed. Just pull me off the ladder. I think she pulled me off the ladder. Oh no. Stripper. going on here. Oh, this isn't good. Parkour! Come on, come on, stamina, help me out. All right, he's waiting. <laughs> Thank you for being understanding with the zombie. All right, we're good. Oh, this is a uh, this is a unique POI. As you can see, uh oh, one coming in from the outside. I think one's coming in from the outside. What I was gonna say is that, oh, right there. Where'd you freaking fall in at then? What I was trying to say is, as you can see, I have a piece of armor that is showing that it's in critical condition. That would be my shoes. They're, they're lumberjack shoes. And I could not figure out how to fix them. It doesn't say, I don't think. Lumberjack boots. Form-fitting ankle support prevents quick fatigue in the woods. Reduces stamina costs in sprinting, uses less stamina and using axes, but it doesn't say how to fix it. I had leather, cloth, and plant fibers, and I couldn't figure out any way to fix it, so it must take a repair kit. That's the only other thing I could think of. this scavenger hat find better quality loot what do I have right now oh, I have the primitive hood yeah, I'm not gonna use the scavenger hat it slows down my mobility it does have a little bit better light armor rating though uh oh something hears me Got another one coming in. Did he already come down here? Alright, that's how I get back out. Oh, that's where she fell in. I don't think I can shoot through this. No. There we go, there's some aloe vera seeds, I guess. Oh, is there two up there? Shit. I need to reload these guns. Whoa, 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 whoa.
Do it. Alright, got that one. Okay, I think that's all for this place. Get the hell out of here. Oh, he just fall down? Yeah. Oh, it's a big guy too. That snake made a person like sighing sound when I hit it. I do want to check this place out, but I don't want to fall into here. See? Yeah, that's a damn trap. see so I can make the aloe cream out of four aloe vera leaves perfect so I just need to keep those because then I'll be able to make some medical bandages I've got this armor plating mod I'm gonna put this on I guess my primitive outfit oh, I can't um, I can put it on my gloves maybe yep Armor plated gloves. Perfect. Alright, that's it. Heading back to the trader. I'll stop by base on the way and drop off loot. Oh shit. Oh shit. God damn it. <laughs> oh, no. Bikers. Made it back home. I'm gonna go put down a drop chest. I can just drop things off, organize them later. Alright, there we go. Temporary. Alright, let's go see the trader. Get lost, bum. Well, you proved me wrong. Now take your reward. Alright, what do we got? Still here. nothing that good. Sniper I'll take the lock fix, I guess. Oh, here we go. Tier 1 complete. I'm gonna take the bicycle. What's this? Gatherer. Surface cooling increases the rate of dew collection. Mmm. That's something for the dew collector. That's pretty cool, but I can't turn down faster transportation and more storage room. 
Special jobs. We have a uh, opening trade routes mission two kilometers Look, to the kid, north. I'll give you some work. To Trader Jen. Not it's a deal. Take Disappoint that. Disappoint me, and you'll find yourself on the wrong end. Of and the road. I will take. I guess this clear zombies oh, mission. This is the closest one. Dumpsters and finally Camp ready Carlson. To do some work. You better not fuck this up. All right, I'll good to go. Goddamn throat. Now I need food. I'll take a couple of large beef rations. Well, we've got ourselves a bicycle. So that's pretty huge. This is where I'm going to call it for this episode. A weird time of day but next episode is going to be the horde whether it is the night of day seven which is tonight or the night of day eight thank you for watching hope you enjoyed and i will see you soon